Hello, fine people. Today, since I didn't have breakfast, I'm gonna make some eggs, but I'm going to record it because why not? But first, I need to fix the lighting. Yes, this is a new headset. Yes, these are glasses, but with actual lenses. And, oh uh, yeah, um, I got a switchblade and a trainer knife from San Diego. It's just, I didn't have internet in San Diego to post the video. And, yeah. Um, yeah, I should probably, uh, I was thinking of putting you on that side so you could, like, see more stuff, but, yeah, that's not quite gonna work, so, you're probably just gonna have to deal with it. And if you guys want to make eggs too, I would recommend you follow how I do it. Why are you not open? I usually take two eggs just to, you know, have more to eat. cheese but like um I would like put butter on some uh slices of bread and do that but instead of a grilled cheese sandwich I would make an egg sandwich it's so good and um you know I might want a pan there's pans please be long enough oh you're definitely long enough you know if I'm actually going to be like, you know, having fire going on a stove, and don't worry, I, um, I'll be perfectly fine, but like, um, if I'm going to have this cord next to fire, that's not going to work out, because these head, th this headset is at least a day old, for, uh, for me. Like, I've had this headset for almost a year. I'm just unlocking the stir. Hold on. I'm back. It's just I needed to find the canola oil. The canola oil. And, um, yeah. Okay, good. There is still some stuff in this. That's good. But what I usually do sometimes is, um, I'll grab, like, one of these and put the eggs in it and, like, mix it around. And, because, like, it's way easier than just trying to do it over an open flame and a, you know, burning hot pan. I like to just pour it in. And, um,. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So, get that going.
and don't worry, I will be perfectly careful about my surroundings. This probably would have been better if I had a Bluetooth headset and a microphone. So, working with what I got. So now we wait about like one through four minutes. So I'm going to pause it. And, yeah. Don't, don't worry, it's just a humidifier. I'm fine. Oh, no. Got some water on my laptop. Uh, so what I like to do sometimes, which, what I mean by sometimes, I mean all the time, since, that, what, since that's usually what you have to do, I put my hand under some water, and to check if the pan is hot enough, flick it and it'll make like a little sizzly noise. Hold on. Just like that. So what I would do is turn down the flame so it's not as hot. And crack the eggs into the mixing cup, I would yeah, get out. Thank you. I'm going to go throw this out. So I will be right back. Hello and I am back. I'm going to crack the second egg. So yeah. And if you think my appearance is sloppy, I'm fine with that because this is the most comfortable clothing I have. Soft pants, very soft shirt. It's actually very soft on the inside. That sounded very wrong. Sorry about that. And, um, yeah. Just keep mixing it around. I should probably have one muff out so I can actually hear stuff better. And so you think it looks fine? You can pour it out. But before you do that, you might want a plate and possibly a spatula. I think that's what it is. And if you're wondering what I mixed the eggs with, I used a wax. Whip. Whisk. So while that's going around it, put this in the sink and wash it. So after you do that, turn the flame up again and try to, you know, spin around the head. I usually like mine running, so this video is going to be kind of short. And I might want to get some gloves. There you go. I know these are for like ovens and stuff, but uh, I'm trying to scratch this up. Ah, oh, much better. 
Uh, it's just what I have. I don't want to, you know, have egg exploding on my hand. And that's pretty much it. But if you need to, you can put it back on and do it for even longer if it doesn't look that well. Eh. And um, when you're done, just put everything in the sink. Turn off the flame, of course. Um, Keep the gloves on, or at least like, after you're done moving everything and making space in the sink, um, put the gloves back on, just so you don't burn your hands, because I almost did that once. Well, actually I did do that once, it's just, it was only for like one second, um, and I'll go on this side, it'll be cool. And if you're actually going to do that, you might want to get a towel so you don't set off your smoke alarms. Just because of the heat and stuff. Three, two, one, now. And then just scan it. And then, you know, move around the faucet. You can get everything open. And then, when you're actually done with that, put the gloves back on, and, uh, oh, excuse me, um, pick up the pan, and pour it all in water so your pan doesn't get all rusty. And, happy Hanukkah, even though it's not Hanukkah, your eggs are done. But... Yeah, I said but, so deal with it. If you want, put on your toppings. I usually put on, like, salt and pepper. Um, turn, turn, turn. Okay. Just put it all on top. And voila, your eggs are done. Bye now. Uh, sorry about the very long video. Well, it's actually kind of short, but yeah, bye. Make sure to like and subscribe.